In the grand arena of battle rap, the Gnome 14 main event delivered an electrifying spectacle, cementing Loaded Lux's legendary status. Lux's performance was impeccable, with not a single filler bar in his three rounds. The sheer quality and consistency of his verses were nothing short of extraordinary. In stark contrast, Rum Nitty's reliance on exaggerated performance and cartoonish bars fell short. While Nitty's energy was undeniable, his approach lacked the depth and substance that Lux brought to the table. Lux's commanding presence and profound lyrical content distinguished him as the superior competitor, effortlessly outclassing Nitty. Loaded Lux dominated every round, his focused and relentless delivery underscoring the levels that separate him from his peers. The battle rap community was abuzz, many expecting Nitty to triumph, but Lux's soul-stirring bars left no room for doubt. His talk was different, powerful, and soul-penetrating, while Nitty's random bars seemed disjointed in comparison. Lux's line, every killer you think is next to me is not adjacent, adjacent, epitomized his sophisticated wordplay and strategic genius. Despite Nitty's attempt to diversify his approach, his gun bars and punches were not enough to overcome Lux's overwhelming prowess. As a result, Nitty found himself metaphorically sent back to the drawing board, unable to match Lux's intellectual and lyrical might. As the event concluded, it was clear that Lux operated on a different plane, showcasing an unparalleled level of artistry. The anticipation now turns to the future. Who will step up to face the unstoppable loaded Lux next? Could it be Hitman Hala? Gnome 14 was a resounding success, living up to every bit of the hype. The next event, Queens vs. Kings, featuring battles like Jazz vs. Tay Rock and John John vs. Coffee Brown, promises more thrilling matchups. While some might balk at the $45 price tag for the pay-per-view, the quality of URL TV TV's pay-per-view remains top-notch. Do you believe Loaded Lux's focused and substance-heavy approach sets him apart as the greatest in battle rap? Or can someone like Hitman Hala challenge his throne? Don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button, and stay tuned for more exhilarating battle rap action. Peace.